everybody. Welcome to this month's Ruby Hangout. Uh, tonight we're going to try something a little bit different. Uh, we don't really have any uh, special guests tonight except for the entire community. So, welcome. Uh, how's it going, Jim? You're, you're just here to jump in and see us get started. So we're, we're going to try something a little bit different tonight. Um, we've opened up the Hangout to let anybody jump in. Uh, our guest tonight is the entire community. <laughs> and what we're going to do is try and write a little program together uh, online, all at once, all of us together. So it should be an uh, interesting, uh, interesting try, interesting attempt. Uh, we'll see how it works. Uh, I've tweeted out links to the Hangout itself and the YouTube link. Um, please, if you can, jump into the Hangout. If that gets full, the YouTube link is streaming live, this Hangout as well. So you'll just be a little bit time shifted. If you do manage to get in, uh, then that's great. Uh, just feel free to keep trying to get into the Hangout itself. Um, but again, you won't need to be on here for, uh, for this to work because uh, we're going to be using Google Docs, and I think that's going to allow as many people as we'd like to, to play. So uh, without further ado, uh, let me put out this uh, link to the doc so that you all can kind of see what I'm doing. Um, I was just recently at this event called Ruby Decamp, uh, which is kind of like an unconference, uh, and it was a whole lot of fun. One of the things we did uh, that a friend of mine put together was this thing called Hive Mind Programming, which was a little bit crazy, um, but a lot of fun. The idea is that everybody gets to write one line of a program, and that we run it every time somebody writes a line. Uh, I'm going to run it on my laptop here. I'm going to screen share the actual output. Um, so please don't do anything crazy like shell out and run like rm-rf or anything, stuff like that. I'll be filtering it before it gets run, so it's not going to work anyway. Um, but yeah, you know, it should be fun. So let me, uh, let, let me tweet out the link to the Google Doc. Uh, okay, and I'll also put that in IRC. And I'll put it also here in uh, the Twitter comments. Uh, whoops. Bear with me. Okay. Oh, post. Oh, right. YouTube doesn't allow you to put URLs, so I'm going to mangle this just a little bit. <laughs> it really doesn't want it. All right, so that's bit.ly slash that code. Okay. Uh, if you come in after the fourth person in the Hangout, feel free to unmute and say hi. Um, let's talk about this uh, while we're doing it. <laughs> Otherwise, I'm just going to be talking into an empty room, and that's, that's kind of weird. <laughs> so um, let's see. We've got... Really just uh, a simple program here that's doing nothing but puts. Let me start the screen share. Uh, and hi. Hey. Okay. So now that I'm screen sharing, I won't be able to see who's talking. So um, please say your name uh, when you talk. And somebody's typing. Note this is an example of a... Note comment. Not sure what you mean. Um, all right, so I'll be running this in Ruby 2.10. Uh, I hope you guys can see my screen. Can you guys see it all right? Somebody say okay. It's a little small, but uh, I right, can, I can make it out. There we go. I'll blow up the output a few. All right, so uh, let me go ahead and I have to run a little script every time I want to run, to run this. So there we go. I'm actually using a Google Docs command line tool here to pull down the Google Doc into a text file, convert it to a Ruby script, and then run it automatically with um, iNotify. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. So, who wants to go first? Yeah, we're going to code random stuff and, and kind of see what happens. Yeah, it's a little bit like telling a story. Um, I don't know what's going to happen. Uh, I've got some ideas up my sleeve if uh, if we don't have anybody jump in, but somebody go ahead and uh, go ahead and go. Okay. 
<laughs> I'm going to let the uh, YouTube stream catch up a little bit. Okay, a little bit of direction. Uh, let me try this. All right, that's my line. I'll go ahead and run it. And, uh-oh. Oh, <laughs> right. Google Docs is uh, giving me the wrong uh, quotes here. Uh, give me just a minute. I have to actually adjust my script. <laughs> That's kind of funny. I hope you guys can watch me code here. Uh, so... Let's do that one and these two. Y'all get to watch me type live here. That'll be interesting. <laughs> Maybe I should blow this one up. Oh, weird. Were those two the same quotes? I guess they were. After seeing your work with uh, this sabotage exercise at Decamp, I'm afraid to code with you. <laughs> uh, that's cool. It's not so bad. Jim, Jim is a smart man. <laughs> All right, let me try that one. Hmm. Oh, unterminated quote a string. Oh. Ooh, Still interesting. Have to quotes. Yeah. No. Um. It's uh. Oh right. It's my shell. My shell script. Still not working. All right. Screw it. Let's <laughs> do this. I guess it's file to read, isn't it? Yeah, there's a bit of a lag on the YouTube stuff. Um, if you can get in, it's better, because it'll be better live. Um, but if not, sorry. Anybody want to tell me what to write? Because I'm going off memory here. <laughs> So I completely missed that um, that whole section of the hive mind programming at Decamp. So I'm not sure what to write yet, but we're gonna have a little fun, I'm sure. Oh yeah, no, that's fine. We don't do enough programming in the in the hangout, so I figure it'd be more fun to try it. I think you're missing a test. <laughs> it's true, I am. I'm totally missing missing tests. Okay. What? What's your beef? Invalid multi bike care. Uh oh. Oh, what am I missing? Is there like an X or something on regexes to allow multi-byte characters? No, X isn't it, is it? Dang it. Who knows this one offhand? Where's oh, Nora Samrel when you need her? <laughs> No, 
Let's see. I am Googling very fast. Oh, right. Of course. Coding. Voila. <laughs> okay, let's see if that works. Uh-oh. All right. Different interpreter now. Can't convert string into integer. Oh, right. Read lines. All right. Hey. Cool. All right, that's almost there. Mostly the problem is is that I'm not doing this right. Hello? Hi. I should have tested my code more, huh? <laughs> yeah, interesting. I'm still seeing... I think we're seeing the fruits of Decamp. <laughs> yeah, indeed. And along with some code? <laughs> Spent too much time <laughs> antagonizing people with the, the antagonistic uh, no, that one works. Uh, you know, as long as he doesn't oh. redefine the output from our spec, we're good. Right. This is the problem here. Voila. And do this. There we go. <laughs> okay, so that didn't work because... This is not a Mac, and there's no cellos. <laughs> Anonymous Buffalo is writing a lot more than one line, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to um, open up the chat. Oh, I can't. All right, anonymous buffalo, you're uh, <laughs> you're breaking the rules here. <laughs> so you posted the link in Twitter for the uh, Google Docs. Uh, yeah. Okay, I'm gonna I'm just gonna kill the cellos one here now that we're working, cause uh, that's just gonna be exploding all the time. All right, so we're good to go. This should be working. Yeah. Okay. All right, and that was Mink. Hey, what's going on? Howdy. Can you hear me? Yeah. Yeah, we can. I think I was muted. What's I up, dude? What's going on? I clicked the link on my Twitter, and I'm on here. You are. You're totally on here. We're doing a live code together kind of thing. All right. So that one was Mink. We're going to go ahead and run it on with Mink's stuff. Hi. There we go. What's, go. what's going on? How are you doing? Good. Looks like that search for palindromes didn't work. Oh, because you're trying to split um, an array that's already split. We got the split already there. Do you want to fix that, Mink? There you go. Cool. All right. We'll see how that works. Hmm. What's it saying? It's saying split for array. What are you giving sample? Zero? Try it again, because I don't think it... I think that's the old error. Yeah, let me try one more. What are you passing the sample? Hmm. No, it's still blowing up. So words is equal to file read split, right? Yeah. Sample five. Why would you um, give a five? 
for five random words. Well, no, that but that's after the fact, though. <laughs> words are set to sp- to the split of the dictionary. Yeah, and then, and then you're sampling five you, and joining them. What are you getting from sample five? No. No, no, no. That's working. Line six works. So that's the five you get. And then when I'm trying to search on words, Honk it's not back. keeping it. Let yeah, that's weird. Let me see the code. I can only see the sample part. I can't see anything else. Oh, you can't? No matter how close I get on my phone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in Belgium right now. I actually have to prepare for a talk tomorrow. But oh, wow. Oh, you're in your tomorrow. phone. That's yeah, awesome. it's like it's 1 a.m. here. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> and I got the Google Hangout link. And I was like, oh, hey. That is dedication, well, live. <laughs> I, I so let me see. Have to talk. So, but let me look let at this code. I, I can't see it. Read this to you. I've got put space can you, parens. Can you put it in a gist? Uh, it's in a Google Doc. If you can load that. How? There's a link. There's on, uh, the link in Twitter. Here's the Google Doc. We'll be editing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Everyone writes one file. You can put your line anywhere in the file. Oh, you can't edit oh. someone else. Did you figure it out? Yeah, there's no search on array. You have to select. Select, sorry. Duh. I was writing SQL. <laughs> a, little bit of, a little bit ago, I was writing SQL is why. Uh-oh. What search? Oh, wow. It doesn't work with comments. Comments screw that up. Sorry, Ben. I'm killing your comment. <laughs> what search? Where do you get search from? Search doesn't exist. There it's, we go. It's it's supposed to be select. Uh, I was writing SQL just a little bit ago too, and I'm like, I don't know why I went to search. See, this is why you keep me around. <laughs> <laughs> this is why. Why is that? Doesn't seem like what it was supposed to be. Where am I again? There's like new lines coming in out of out of nowhere. I think it's just not finding well, any palindromes ch- within that uh, sample of five. Do w dot reverse dot chomp. No, did your did your uh, read lines get changed? No. What is it no. about read oh. lines versus file read? You're gonna read. It was, you're gonna. No, they switched it from read read split to read lines. That should be the same, but there's it's no, no longer there's, being split. There's gonna be new lines. Somebody share. Somebody changed line six. Is the problem? And yeah. Now line yeah. seven won't work. I'm gonna put line six back because you're not supposed to edit old lines. Don't don't edit old lines. Yeah. <laughs> ah. This is pairing pairing at its best right here. <laughs> Too many chefs. Yeah, take out the user bin and Ruby thing. Don't need that. <laughs> don't need don't need any of those comments. Comments are useless. Please don't. Comments are lies. Get that out of there. Puts bracket. Words equals. <laughs> <laughs> there's your first problem. Wait a minute. There's still. That's because it's a read. It was a read lines. Yeah, try. that got changed. There's a there's a funky character in there still. Mm. And the funky character come in. You can edit someone's line. Huh. This is weird. Uh, it's stopping at this quote. Can I see? It's the... Oh, it's because there's a... We just try. Oh, no, it should be smart enough. It's missing a, a curly brace on the right. Yeah. Is it the select? There's a, the, it's missing a curly brace on the right of the select. Yeah, it's a... Uh, stupid smart quotes. Yeah, do another... Well, no, it's it's just missing the... I think it's missing the yeah. curly brace. No, here we go. It's more... It's just... More UTF-8 characters. Run it one more time. Ha ha! Cool. Yay! <laughs> I wonder if I if you downcase it, then there'll be more matches. I think, but that's okay. Okay. Who's next? That's my contribution. Sweet. Somebody okay, jump in me... there. Yeah, I'm doing it. Okay. I'm doing it. It's all, why is it all in French Dutch thing? <laughs> why is my whole computer phone on French Dutch? I don't understand. Where'd you say you are in the Netherlands? 
Belgium. Why? Belgium. <laughs> I don't know any of these. It says Ali document and Bürgen and off drunken. Yeah, I'm off. I'm off drunken. All right, but how do I edit this damn thing? I don't know. I need to do my talk. I'm so tired. What are you talking about, Zach? Shoes. Shoes. What is wrong with this thing? Are you at our camp? Yes. That's awesome. I'm just gonna hit buttons till it does what I want it to do. <laughs> Be working. Means. Wait, I have to sign in. C C A K. Gmail. Did you? Is that your cursor? Did you jump in? Can you see my, what I'm typing? Uh. I think it's being slow because you're on your phone. Normally it's live, but... Can you see what I'm typing? Because I'm typing in my password. I'm like, <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> Don't lie to me. No, we can't see it at all. <laughs> Don't lie to me. I need your password with curly cat mustaches. All right, you're lying. <laughs> hey, wait, no, I don't think that was your password. Did it change it? <laughs> it didn't work anyways oh sign out nope refresh print I can print it <laughs> oh I can just edit it right here on my phone okay so what we're gonna do yeah. is I'm in I'm in sweet it's logging me in again what the hell so the um the, the rules are we can't change the line before you what does that mean change previous lines, but you can insert anywhere. So you can insert a line in between lines without any problem. Can you see my screen? Uh, I don't see you doing anything yet. Can you see what I'm typing? No. Alright, then I just type my password in again. Why do I keep doing this? <laughs> Everyone has everything on me right now. <laughs> Ruby Hangouts. Don't worry, the NSA is backing it up for you in the cloud. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> It just sent me to, like, the worst place ever. I don't understand this. I don't understand Google, like, docs. Like, how does this all work? What does this button do? Ginger joined? My cat is in? <laughs> Who's Ginger? Like, what How's is it going, this? Ginger? You come in muted. If you want to say hi, you can unmute at the top. What's my cat doing on, on the Internet? <laughs> You're supposed to be in Vermont. I'm like, what is this? Hang oh. out URL. Somebody's getting it in there. All right, I'm in. Is that you typing the the palindrome's copy? No, that's somebody else, isn't it? No, that's someone else. That's the anonymous tiger. Okay. That's my cat. All right, All right anonymous tiger. I'm gonna go ahead and run run your thing. Uh. What happened? You have done what you expected. Who broke it? <laughs> I don't want to work anymore. What do you mean your talk isn't done? God. Oh, oh, right. So the problem is you're missing an end quote. Here, I'll just add it. There we go. <laughs> Zach, feel free to jump in still. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Okay. So the goal is what? What is our goal? Uh, the goal is to have fun. <laughs> the goal is to figure out the goal. There is no goal. Just like sense. there is no cake. What is Mad Eye? I'm going to jump off for a little bit. I'll be back a little bit later. Yeah, checking, cool. Checking on you guys, make sure you're not in too much trouble. So I learned this one today. Well, I didn't really learn it. But... So if I have Ruby hanging out, I can do death self dot creative. Oh, weird. Mad Eye is a node thing. 
How do we do tabs on this phone? <laughs> Base dot class. Multi line items as helpers. Um space, 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 space. And then I can do like um def. Um, puts, puts, puts. Hello. Okay. Is it the Ruby Hangout or is it just Ruby Hangout? The Twitter handle? Yeah. Uh, it's um Ruby Hangout. Hangout. So we're trying, for those of you who are watching this later on YouTube, I'm just going to say, we're talking about maybe using MadEye. I think MadEye is going to take some setup, so I probably won't be able to get that going really right now. Uh, and then also we were talking about doing multi-line helpers, or multi-line items. <laughs> and I think somebody's saying it seems like cheating. And I think it's, yeah, I would agree cheating. But... I might allow it. You can do class string def palindrome self length. <laughs> we can do that, right? Um, I don't know. I'm working on something. All right, sync. Whoa! <laughs> We're on that. That's more than one line, Zach. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I added like 15 lines. I'm sorry. <laughs> you did add like 15 lines. <laughs> <laughs> I, was, I was coding on my phone. It takes forever. I didn't know. I didn't read the rules. Uh, can you make that one line? <laughs> Yes. Just give me a minute to send you call on all of this. So yeah, I kinda <laughs> agree with that one. We should we should make every line amend to a or amend or every line have an output variable or have its output assigned to a variable so that we can amend somebody else's output. I feel like we should start with what I have and then <laughs> and append and then append. split it into one line and sort of no, no, use like module prepend and and add some crazy stuff to this. Thing. <laughs> That's what we should do. You should do that. You should try. You should totally do that. So multi line multi multi line monkey patching. I can do it. You want me to? Or you want me to refinance this thing? <laughs> oh oh oh! This is two ten. Two ten. So what? So we're calling it in the states. Two one oh two point one. Two point one. 2.1, yes. That's different from 2.10, isn't it? Because there's no patch level. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we don't do patch levels in Ruby. <laughs> <laughs> someone someone brought up, I think it was Akinori Musha's song, he brought up the idea of semantic versioning for Ruby. <laughs> it's like, good idea, but very difficult to implement. We would have to be very careful about security things, and so it's nice to just have like all release and then security releases. But anyways, yeah, difficult. Yeah, that would be nice. Yeah, all this right. is two one. Which is, I'm glad you're using that. It's really great. Yeah, man. Of course. Good stuff. But I don't think your I don't think your hello hello worked. Maybe I have to run it again. Someone yeah, someone had seen some stuff. Oh. Undefined method hello for hello. Include. Maybe it's self dot hello. Let me edit this. <laughs> I think, yeah, we need self. Self. Dot. Try that. Uh, undefined method hello. Hello, hello. Hello, include Ruby Hangout. 
self included. Go for it, alligator. Do you guys see what animal you are? No. Uh. What's it tell me? What's my animal? A cat. You were. Better be, better be a cat. I don't think you get an animal because you're on a phone. There's an anonymous Nyan cat in there somewhere. <laughs> I saw Ginger, my cat, connected, and then I left. <laughs> How do I see who's, see who's in here? Oh, there it goes. It's working. Oh, there's actually a cat. <laughs> oh, a cat. Get back here. There's totally an anonymous Nyan cat. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I need to do my talk. All right, Zach. You're coming and stomped all over our uh, our nice rules. Sorry. <laughs> I wrote some code. I wanted to share it. All right, I'm gonna make your thing follow the rule. Are you kicking me? No, I'm just ruling it. <laughs> Getting really the first the first person to get kicked from Ruby Hangout. <laughs> I don't. I think you have to do. Class eval do. I think I messed that up. Did I not? Oh, you're doing box. Yeah, I'm just converting it to a one liner. Alright. Let me see if that works. Yes, it does. Okay. So then I can also <laughs> make your other thing. The rest of this all one line and. These semicolons are totally cheating, by the way. <laughs> Here, I can... There, this is less cheating. There. Let's see if that works. Yes, it does. <laughs> Although VI apparently doesn't know how to syntax highlight it anymore. <laughs> of course, Zach's line is at the end, so... All right, alligator, you're writing. What are we getting? Let's um let's have a little convention that if you're done, just put like a pound at the end of the line. Okay. Cool. Uh oh. We have a uh, an explosion. <laughs> Why is it blowing up? This looks like correct. The syntax looks okay. Let me just see if I comment that. If it fixes it, it does. Oh, no. It's working alright. Okay. Who's next? If you want, I could... Is that a mad eye? Um, sure. So we totally need to do something like the um, Cards Against Humanity that we did <laughs> in code. Oh, how do we do that? <clears throat> Well, I would uh, I would say we'd have a, a stack of questions and with blanks and uh, a stack of uh, answers that we could sample back out. Okay. So we need two stacks, right? So. Um, Basically, we could set up just a couple of arrays that everybody could add to, and then sample it from that. 
Okay. Go, somebody go for it. And let's see. I'll kill some of these comments. Who is that? Who who's that? That's writing right now. Alligator. That me. Oh, that's you. Okay, that's Jim. You're the anonymous alligator, Jim. <laughs> awesome. shut down. <laughs> Man, this one's going to be bad on the replay. Sorry, guys, watching it on YouTube, but... Um... Oh, one line, one line. Oh, oh one line, one line. Okay. <laughs> All right, somebody else has to... Oh, oh uh, one line. Uh, I'll let the an someone else come up with the, uh, the, the questions since Question. I've done the answers. All right. I'll I'll them. And you can edit mine, right? Or no, you can't edit. But you can add too, because you can. You can, yeah, you can add. You can, add you can you can add to it. So. Okay. Let's see. Uh, who's next? Who wants to? Who wants to go? Did you guys see that comment that I just put in in the chat yes, on the Google? Yeah, okay. the one this just sample should work. Oh, oh no, 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 that wasn't me. I was trying to use a different Google Docs chat thing to try that. All right, go for, go for it. <laughs> so I'm the crocodile, you said, right? Alligator. Alligator. Yeah. Only fitting. I'm going to Miami. I'm being. <laughs> Somebody's anonymous Nyan cat who just highlighted everything. <laughs> it's really amusing. Anonymous Elfrit. <laughs> yeah. Anybody jumping in? Go for it. All right. You know you want to, Josh. Uh, no, that's not responses because you have answers already. Right. These are sayings or questions, maybe. Okay. I think for a thing to work, it's gonna have to only be like one thing at a time. Right. Oh, things. That's oh so wonderfully clear. <laughs> That thing about Bob. I think you should go with with the variable name R and R one and R two and R three. Like that? Yeah, just all your variables named R with a number after them. That way it's clear. Okay, Mad Eye is not is it is oh so the problem with Mad Eye is I now have to copy and paste this whole thing. So are we move into from this to Mad Eye. Uh, let me just give it a quick shot. I do like the syntax highlighting. <laughs> Although I don't think it's doing the right syntax highlighting.
Uh, no, you don't. I will. Copy paste. <laughs> that must be the anonymous dog. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. That's that's enough for my line. Who's next? Are we are we doing Mad Eye still, or are we doing Google Docs? Uh, I'm going to stay in Google Docs for the moment. Okay. Oh, so you do now have an R1 and R2. I was kidding, by the way. Oh, I figure why not? Um, you know, R1, R2, all the way to R26, and then when we got to go, we got to go to R or, or S, S1 to S26, since there's you know 26 letters in the alphabet. Letters in the alphabet? No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm making fun of, of the lack of naming conventions we use elsewhere. Uh, I see. Oh, right, of course, yes. <laughs> I, I guess this is public, so I don't want to mention where. Okay, I'm going to actually screen share the, the doc, since we said most of be... We're doing some stuff in here right now. Okay, so now that we've got your um, R1 and R2 in there, we're going to have to, now we need, we're going to have to supply two different ones for one, and so we have to write a, some sort of parser, right, to figure out that it's got an R, need an R1 to fill in and an R2 to fill in. Well, or you could just use regular expressions. They're not regular. Then you have two problems. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I I knew I was gonna start that with the slim shutdown. <laughs> <laughs> R1 equals House Republicans, R2 equals Answers sub 2, puts things that G sub uh, escapes very good expression R1. For R1, syntax problem there. Yeah, you need a. No, no, no. You have you can't, you can't use a inline regular expression like that. It has to be comma and then a string. Right, and you're gonna need to figure out which things you're gonna put those answers to, right? Or are you gonna do all of them at once? Looks like they've got it right there at the beginning of the line. Sorry, keeps adding me to this thing. <laughs> you just want to hang out. I yeah, I do really bad. <laughs> what? Is there a lot of drinking at our camp? No, no. How do I get out of this thing? You there's don't. No you're trapped forever. There's no, there's no drinking involved. Never. Uh. Um. Hanging out, dude. What you got to do is you got to click on the telephone icon thingy on the uh, top right corner of the screen. Yeah. Yeah. But you don't really want to do that because you want to hang out with other Rubius, it's right? True. Um, I don't get the thing, but... I mean, how often do you get to hang out with an anonymous tiger and an anonymous alligator and an anonymous man cat? cat? Exactly. <laughs> it's fine, you know what? I'm just going to leave it going because I have no control over it. <laughs> it just right. keeps sending me in here, so whatever. That'll probably run. I'm going to run it. All right, hang on. Let me switch my screen sharing back. Is this an open source project? <laughs> you bet. <laughs> right on. 
So open it fell out. Unknown refresh option. Gee. Did you delete? You deleted all my code, didn't you? No, it's there. It's just been semicoloned. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't worry about it. It's all good. Don't Looks like you it. can't use G's. Uh, anonymous tiger, whoever that was that was typing the, the regular expressions there. Just gonna trim some white space here. Check this out. See this outlet? Okay. Yeah. This is what we have in, in Belgium. What is that? <laughs> it's hardcore. My it's my adapter. So I can get on get charging get charging on my, my thing. It looks like a lethal weapon. <laughs> <laughs> Basically. Okay. The outlets here are really weird. How does this work? How does this thing plug in? There we go. Cool. All right. We'll run that. Oh, I just broke the bed. Okay. I'm feeling really embarrassed. These young fellow geek bachelor dudes are have a cleaner cleaner digs than than I do. I want to relocate over to the sofa so that you guys can't see my messy house. <laughs> Why do you think most of us don't have a video feed at all? <laughs> it's because we were trying to help out the bandwidth, I promise. <laughs> it looks like we've got... Oh, right, because you're trying to G-sub the array itself. You need to G-sub each element in the array. What project is this? Uh, do you have a repo? No, no, we're just having fun in Google Drive or in Google Docs. Yeah. Oh, just fucking around? Yeah, just screwing around. Here, um, there's a link to the, the Google Doc. And if the collection company wants to repo this, they're welcome to it. <laughs> hey, we just put it in the chat again here on the Hangout if you want to jump in. Yeah. yeah, the rules are pretty simple. One line at a time and don't change somebody else's line. Yep, that's about it. I forgot the password to my Wi-Fi. <laughs> <laughs> it's on my phone, but it's not on my computer. Does anyone know how to find that out? You just can't get on anymore. You're stuck here with us. Is there a way to find out a password out from your phone? I don't think that I know how. You guys are a trip. What do you have to do? Sorry, what was that? <laughs> you guys are a trip. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> We're just trying to help each other out. I know. With with programmers against humanity, how bad can it be? I don't really know how computers work, so... <laughs> There's always that. How do, how do I figure out my password? I don't know. They t Like he told me, I could go wake him up. It's only it's only two a.m. All right, I'm going to just go ahead and uh, fix this here. Fuck, fuck all the things. All right, and let's try that. Hey, there it goes. <laughs> okay, who's next? Anybody? I would have if I knew how to get my internet. <laughs> Anonymous hippo. hippo. Looks like you're jumping in. Oh, or gopher. <laughs> okay, here we go. I was like, do, dopey dopey or something. Oh my god. I got it. What? 
Dopey Dopey. That's my internet password. Uh. I got it. This <laughs> <laughs> will be a little easier. Got some new followers. It's always good. New followers? Yeah. Getting cool. On there. Getting on there, yeah. Alright. Uh, okay. Uh, Turn this on. Okay. Okay, so I'll run that. Nope. Which pulls are? Uh oh. Oh, you forgot to fix the other reference to uh, template. There we go. Did I lose you? Check, check, check. No, oh, you're still there. Hey, what's going on? Chilling. Keeping it real. You know. Doing my <laughs> slides. I gotta speak in two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Eight hours? I got enough. <laughs> I got enough time. Totally. You don't need sleep. Sleep is for the week. It is. You want to see some slides from Nickel City? Sure. Yeah, that? I was at Nickel City. Can you see that? Get, get off my lawn. <laughs> See that? Oh, and there's a cows. Yeah. They're they're <laughs> bu they're buffalo. Buffalo. What are they doing on the lawn? Are Don't. they anonymous buffalo? No, they're chunky buffalo. <laughs> chunky buffalo. <laughs> Campbell's chunky buffalo. Mm -hmm. Are you still on your phone, Zach? No, I switched my laptop. I got on the internet. Ah, uh, okay. I gotta do my slot. Yeah, I found the password. It was Dopey Dopey. <laughs> oh, oh, right. So you, you fixed it. Okay. Yeah, Sorry. I'm on my um, people's Wi-Fi. Someone's put me up for this conference, so I'm on their Wi-Fis. Nice. Got to do my talk slides. Oh, it looks like uh, whoever wrote that last line forgot to put it. There we go. Escape it. I need to open all this. I did this talk last week, but I wanted to review and write some new slides. <laughs> there we go. Ordain loves it when mainlining does fatal. Circumventing loves it when Legionnaires does twosome. <laughs> Fantastic. Deliver yeah. loves it when Leopold's does Liverpool's. I think I saw that. <laughs> All right, who's next? <laughs> Jim, Jim Nanny's in here. Why does that name sound familiar? Um, I was here last month, and I was at D Camp. Oh, and were you were you at my thing? Uh, yes. Maybe that's why. Jim's also doing the Ruby on Sales thing. Yeah, I'm, oh. I'm the Ruby on Sales guy. Oh, were you at one of the conferences? <laughs> uh, RubyConf, RailsConf, and DCamp, uh, and BarCamp. Oh. Two <laughs> songs. Oh, I didn't to go know. to DCamp. Deliver loves it when Leopold's does Liverpool's. I think oh, I is that. it? So, <laughs> Ed, so, so Edward. Right, who's next? <laughs> Jimmy. Jimmy. Yep, thanks. Ed, you were on... You needed to mute yourself because you were getting a bad echo from the from the YouTube's. 
I right. am speaking at RubyConf, and I would love a Ruby on Sales ticket. Thanks. Well, you know, it just so happens that there are um, four boats that aren't sponsored, and if they don't get sponsored, there's going to be four tickets up for grabs. What does that mean? That Do means, I have a ticket uh, or not? That means I'm going to... Um, <laughs> I'm going to beg for money from lots of people to help cover costs, and then I'm going to have four tickets that I'm going to have to say, who wants one at, at the day of? I don't have money. I am a speaker. This is <laughs> by, by the way, I'm actually really seriously considering making it an actual conference next year. That sounds good. I think it would be cool. One day, of, one day of talks and one day of actually uh, 60 people out on the boats at a time mm. and three trips. And then while everybody's out on the boats, all the uh, all the rest of the people. Who's going so far? The, uh, Arduinos and uh, remote control sailboats. Mm, and then the third day of uh, talks. I want to be on a boat with my we friends. Should, we should do talks on the boat. Yeah. Who's going? Actually, we should do the decamp style talks where it's conversations. Hmm. How many? Okay. How, how many people are going? Uh, to Ruby on Sales this year? Yeah. It's um. We're setting at uh, roughly one seventy six at this point. No, I'm sorry, one seventy four. That's a lot of people. That's a lot of people. That's a lot well, of people. Only, only, only 60 get to sale. The rest are just coming to the party after. Barbecue? Am I on the barbecue list? Uh, did you sign up? I don't remember. Can you check? Um, are they going to barbecue you? <laughs> the, uh, the, the, the actual... So the barbecue is no longer going to be a barbecue. It's going to be a... Um, a, a a little catered thing at uh, Char House Restaurant right next to the marina. Where's this at? In Miami Beach, right the day before RubyConf. Oh. I think I think you should just let me on one of them because what's one more person and I'm a speaker, so I should just get auto auto invite. Thanks. <laughs> Hey, about that. Crickets. <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I, I'm just trying to figure out which one I'll have to kick off to make that happen, and I'm, I, I don't know. Put me, hey on the one, put me on the one that Eric is on. Hey, guys, can you hear me? Hey. I, I got you. I can hear you. Hey, so uh, I heard at uh, Arlington Ruby that there were still some spots available uh, for free tickets if we help out. Is that true? For what thing? For uh, the conference you guys were just talking about in Florida. Ruby Comp? Yeah. There's still tickets, I think. Maybe it's sold. I don't know. I don't know about free tickets for Ruby Comp. Not free, but there's tickets, I think. I, I think there was eight tickets the other day left, and the only thing that's left now are the um, the people who submitted talks that didn't get um, accepted. If you want to know from Virginia, though, what, what you talked to Jim? Yeah. Right? Okay. Jim Gay? He would know. All he right. might have, maybe he bought like a bunch of tickets and is like offering them. I don't know. <laughs> That'd be cool. Yeah. All right, well, guys. I know so there's still the, um, the, the, what's it called, tickets, the sponsorship tickets or whatnot, where the, you, or the, um, what do they call them? The, the, where the, the, Scholarship tickets, that's what it is. Uh, so, note to self, uh, submit talks that get rejected. I, I that, submitted two that got rejected, and uh, I, I had the ability to buy two extra tickets. You should always submit talks. It's always a good thing to submit a talk. You know, it's it's there's way too many people who don't realize that talks can be by anybody, not just like the... You know what you what everybody seems to be thinking is the superstars. That is true. 
Totally. We need more. We need more people who are not known giving talks, because those usually end up being fabulous. Yeah, that's how you get known. That is exactly true. Well, one of the ways. Yeah, I, I think I'll get known as the wrecker of the world. <laughs> <laughs> that's always good. All right, folks, let's see if we can get a working implementation of Conway's Game of Life here, one line at a time. Oh, wow. <laughs> Life? Oh, that's cool. So I, I just updated the file a little bit, and let's try it out. All right, where are you? You have a class board and a initialized with a grid and a current state. And you know you can always append methods to, to classes. Man, one line at a time. This is weird. Yeah, this will be interesting. It messes with me trying to think of the or look at it with all the semicolons. I'm feeling like you see uh, or something. Let me just refactor this to make it a little more obvious how to continue. Okay. Mm hmm Okay, I have a question. Yeah. Um, I'm make it a class method. Are, are we doing wraparound boards? Sorry. Uh, uh, we can. Yeah. Wraparound boards are probably more complicated. I usually have a little bit easier time with uh, just an infinite grid. Okay, and then uh, can we post somewhere what the rules are? There's a link right there. Uh, oh, okay, right. Basically, if it's alive it, with two or three neighbors, it lives, and if it's dead and it has three neighbors, it comes to life. Okay, how big is our board, and what do we start with? That's up to us. Uh, I would say do a three-by-three three board so that you can do a blinker <laughs> just to get started. <laughs> so right now, grid is uh, an empty array, so somebody should go ahead and update that. Wow, losers. I forgot how to draw, apparently. This is pathetic. <laughs> what am I doing? I decided to do this at 2 a.m. <laughs> well, are we doing the array with, the, uh, with, with just states? Are we actually giving printable characters? I would probably not use printable characters. And I'd they all have to be parsed. And translated. Yeah. Alive, dead. Oh, wait. We, we, have, we have dead, then alive. Then... Alive, alive, alive. Zombified. Dead. <laughs> then the same thing over... So hang on, there's no uh, there's no writer for the grid variable. Does that look like an F? Oh, is oh, oh you did not oh, you didn't make it one. <laughs> so somebody has to define the writer first. So now we have to do a whole go in there and extend it. Right? Let me see. You could do that, yeah. Monkey patch board, or you can add a method to the B variable. Yeah. Yeah, as was done right above. Meanwhile, yeah. I'll start writing the. Uh, On a monkey world. patch. Or, no, let's see. Oh God, this is terrible. Better yet. So wait, Dave, are you trying to do a hash? That's what I was thinking. Just well, store the live cell so you can have an infinite grid without uh, having to change the size. Right, so don't you really want an array there, or you need keys and values? D don't! Yeah. Right. Why don't I just use all of the characters I've already written? <laughs> And make my own font. 
It's, it's apparently not working for me right now. <laughs> what are you doing, Zach? Uh, I'm trying to do my sh my shoes slides, and it's just bad. <laughs> but I have enough characters already written that I could probably redo the whole thing. So I like slides like this. Yeah, this like, one line really messes with my head trying to look at that. I, I really feel like I'm reading C code. <laughs> That's part of the fun. All right, th that looks good. Let's make sure this runs. This is C code to you. You guys are making me a nostalgic. Oh wait, wait. There's no, there's no okay. asterisk, asterisk plus plus. <laughs> you could add it. I, I don't see a pointer dereferenced with a <laughs> to another pointer and then to a function and pointer. To, yeah. <laughs> a, you know when I was pointer to a function that returns a pointer to a int. When I was first right in a ternary statement. An array uh, of integer when pointers. I was learning C, and the guy was talking about pointers. He was saying, "By the way, uh, all of our missiles uh, use C for their guidance, and when pointers are..." Oh, oh, the NSA was listening, and shut you down. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get, America. Uh oh. Cloud backup by NSA. All right, who's next? That's so what that you all get. ran just fine, right? So you get America. God bless. God bless them. <laughs> God. I'm make a really simple current state method. All I can see is all I can think about is that uh, that what's that guy? Hell's Kitchen guy, um, Gordon Ramsay, doing shut it down to the government. Better not. Oh, that's reaching. This might be the worst slides ever. This is just bad. What am I even doing this for? Josh, that is very, that is reaching, man. Huh? I said that is reaching. Why? R dot each reach. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I like it. Hey, I didn't come up with it. You did. All right, let's... Does that compile? Does that work? No. What's wrong? Current state. Super one. Wrong number of arguments. Oh, oh, right. Sorry, grid. I forgot a pair of things. There. Oh, right, because that's putzing. Uh, uh, uh. Right, I want to build up a string. So these things I'm going to append O, and then each one of those I'm going to O. So, Josh, just so you know, i got a friend of mine at work to come in and watch today and I was telling him about how you know readable Ruby is uh -huh. you're just totally ruining this I am totally <laughs> ruining it it's true uh oh I mean he's gonna look at it he's gonna go it's reaching twice to reach into something <laughs> this is for fun <laughs> This is to try and break your head. He's going to go back to work hey. thinking, please give me Java and C Sharp. <laughs> there we go. This is, this is awful. No, know. blink it. You oh, blink wait. it. <laughs> you, know, you know you can do Conway's Game of Life in like one regex, right? <laughs> hey, are we allowed to edit our own lines? I just remembered what it was I was trying to do. I'll give it to you. Go ahead. This is pathetic. Seeing the game of life in, in one regex was kind of scary. I can show you some game of life stuff. I, need, I don't even know what it is, but here, let me show you something. So you got a mouse trap? Oh, wait, that's the other game. 
What's your game of life thing, Zach? Um, game of life. Here, I'm just. Where should I paste it? Uh, you can put it in the hangout chat. Okay. There. Do that. Do that thing. Copy paste that thing. Copy paste okay. that thing. Esoteric. With end curses. No, standard library curses. 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 I need. I need Ruby. <laughs> I don't want to talk tomorrow. Just like get up on stage and be like, "Shoes is awesome. You should use shoes." Goodbye. <laughs> I don't want to do it. I don't even want to do that. The schedule's up for RubyConf. I am speaking on. No, I'm in like the point claw, point Sienna. What does that mean? I'm in the last room. Does that mean I don't get to talk? I'm the first uh, day, right after lunch, in the point Sienna room. The point Sienna? I have no idea. Is that like a room full of points? That is. Maybe. Oh. Dave, uninitialized constant set. Ooh. I'm at the same time as Charles Max Wood. Oh, you're out of luck. And Casey Rosenthal. Yeah, so you're, you're, you you lost out to a rogue? And a, um, is Casey Basho? I don't know who Casey is. Casey Rosenthal. I know the name. I'm Who's in the same room as... I'm in the same room as Koichi, so it can't Pretty be that bad. Koichi was um, a, a Basho guy. He is. So, so you lost to a rogue and Riak. Who said I lost anything? Well, okay. You're competing against a rogue and Riak. I think what he's saying is uh, winning is not speaking. Yes. Yes. I'm not... I'm Winning not. is not speaking and not having to have anything to worry about after the seventh. Yeah, I. This I is honestly the hardest it. talk I've ever I've ever submitted, and I've not even started. I have less than a month. I'm not even ready for this talk, and I have to do it in like four hours. What are you doing your talk on? On what one? <laughs> on shoes. This one in the morning is on shoes, yeah. Why don't you just do life in shoes? Go game of life? Yeah. Um because I don't understand the game of life. <laughs> or if you really want to get like lots of people going, wait what? Do it in small talk. Randy really made it um he he managed to get lots of people very interested. By pairing with somebody and saying, this is how I do it in small talk. I'm not like a technical speaker, and I don't know small talk like that. But my talk is about languages, and I know that I will have to understand them at a certain, to a certain extent, but otherwise just plan on bullshitting my way through it as most times I do. <laughs> languages? What, what are languages? Languages. Oh, languages. Sorry, Sorry I've had... My fair share. <laughs> if I'm slurring, I don't mean it. I'm reading. I'm reading at the same time. It's all good. I'm working on it. Give me a minute. I'll catch up to you. I'm just shocked that I have to speak in the morning again. I hate talking in the morning. Damn it. So did you try? Yeah. Did you try the game of life thing in in uh, curses? I didn't run it, but it looks pretty awesome. Should I run it? Well, you have to run it, dude. Oh. All right, fine. What's the point of me pasting anything? If you're not going to actually it. run it. Like, why would I even bother? <laughs> God. Wrong with you people. <laughs> All right, well, I guess I'm going to kick right. everybody out of the mat, I think. I made a mistake of Dude. opening my, my email. There you go. It's running in my terminal. Yeah. That's pretty slick. You like that? That looks Wait, that's can I, cool. Can I see it on the on this thing? Yeah, you should be able to. There we go. Awesome. Curses. 
That's like. <laughs> I'm not doing these slides. This is not. I'm just going to do my same talk, except I should do it right this time. I can't do this. Can't you should just up. put this up. Instead of anything else, just put up this, this uh, Curses Game of Life. I can't. <laughs> I can't come up with any ideas for this talk. Just talk about how documentation is uh, bad. Documentation is a uh, no. If you don't understand it, it's a documentation book. Uh, it's very quotable. I had thank you. I had um. I had some ideas. But they're not very good. One was I wanted to talk about Rick Steeds. And Rick Steeds. Rick Steves. So if you don't know who Rick Steves is, it's this guy that goes around Europe as a tourist and like writes books about how to experience Europe as a tourist. Oh, the travel guy. Uh, so you, it's my first time in Europe, so I want to say, what would Rick Steves do? <laughs> and I had a hell of a time getting here. It was literally like bus to train to bus to plane to plane to bus to train train to bus to bus to bus. That's crazy. To walk, to walk. It was crazy. But I don't think that's really a great thing to talk about. It's hard to talk about. The other idea I had was... I can't even remember now. It probably wasn't that good. I'm just gonna talk about shoes. I, I can't. I can't <laughs> play around like that. What's the title of your talk? Escaping reality with shoes. Escaping reality with shoes. You should just have like a running shoes to run away from life. <laughs> no. Yeah, basically. Basically, having fun with having fun with code because it's fun to write code, not to be do anything important with it. Fun with shoes. Fun yeah. with fun shoes. With yeah, like, basically. Isn't that cool? I'm okay. sorry. You need props. So what you need <laughs> to do is get a nice pair of shoes to hold up. Those are props. And you do your talk. I that's my, see my problem is I pack really light so. <laughs> just take your shoes off. Throw them at the audience. Just throw them at people, like George Bush. <laughs> yes. <laughs> no, that was somebody throwing it at George Bush. Oh, yeah, that's right. Wasn't that an angry Iranian? Hey, it was an angry Iraqi journalist. Okay. <laughs> I'm scared. So maybe people will throw shoes at you, and, Zach. And he got put in jail for that, so you might want to reconsider that. <laughs> <laughs> I just don't know what to talk about. I have nothing, no, no interesting stories this time. Well, you could talk about the history of shoes. You could talk uh, about how we talked about your talk about shoes in this hangout. I I plan on it, but I don't like, think that's very interesting. I want I want a side story dude, that has nothing eating, to do with shoes. Dude, you're eating your wires. Oh my god, dude, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> you're eating. Oh shit! What are you doing? What That's not spaghetti. Yo, are you hungry? I'm very hungry. I'm always hungry. He's actually a robot. Oh my god! <laughs> that just freaked me out. <laughs> <laughs> Eating his wires is good for him. <laughs> <laughs> it helps you write your talk. Right. I'm not How writing any. Do you talks. have any pudding if you don't eat your wires? I'm not writing any talks. Uh, I don't know about you guys, but I, I can't write Are you or talking code talks? outside of chocolate. I have to eat chocolate. Chocolate and coffee. And I'm, I'm, in, I'm in Belgium, so there's like the best chocolate. Oh, that's yeah. Perfect. Oh, God, you're right. Oh, yeah. Find me chocolate, and I'll go there tonight, right now. I'll go get it. I'll eat all the chocolate. It's 2.30 a.m. I need to eat it. I don't know. I don't want to do this in the morning. I'm super nervous. Is that a hotel room you're in, or is that like a, a hostel? I can't do this in one line. It's a hostel. 
You can do it in one line, Dave. It's a hostile, it. hostile. Uh, depends how much I delegate to the next. Thing. Delegate, man. I can show you some shoe stuff. Can you see my screen? So, Dave, yeah. how did you? Uh, how did uh, uh, your decamp spinoff turn out? Uh, well, I'll talk about that and let somebody else finish my code. <laughs> <laughs> All right, show us um, some few stuff. Hey, Mo! Hey, Mo! No Can't wonder this coat don't the white. There's no, semi no, the cheese. No, no, cheese. Oh, wait a minute. Somebody already uh, had the cheese way back when. Anyway, um, my spinoff, Ruby Day Camp, was sort of a qualified success. I think a fun and educational time was had by all, but uh, all wasn't all that many. Uh, aside from me, there were five people who actually signed up and showed up. Well, actually, four people who signed up and showed up, one person who didn't sign up and showed up, and one person additional who sort of dropped in for a little bit at the end. So where did you have it at? Uh, Pohick Bay Regional Park, shelter number two. It was actually a rather nice venue. Uh, what part of the country on, is that in? Oh, sorry. It's a uh, little ways northeast see, of Ruby D Camp. Hmm? Oh, around north yeah. of Ruby Camp. Okay. I'm gonna do some yeah, stuff. a little closer to me. <laughs> I'm in Fairfax, Virginia. Oh, okay. And so not far north, just very little north. Right. So... About halfway, I guess, between DC and Ruby D Camp. Go on. I, I, I will tell you this: if you have it again next year, I will I will come to yours next year since I did D Camp this year. Well, since I didn't do D Camp this year, I think I'll probably go to well try to go to D Camp next year. Uh, man, uh, if I, I, if I do want... it and do up my own D Camp with to make it um, what B Camp. The Lexi camp? B? Yeah, you could do that. <laughs> well, I, I suppose B camp could be somewhere in like British Columbia or something like that. Well, Birmingham, you know, somewhere actually a little warmer. Yeah, well, do they actually call it BC? Uh, okay, so I'd have to go... Well, you know, the C doesn't have to be part of the name. Well, okay. Well, that was only, you know, Evan's thing. I, I, I am a little different than Evan, so I can say that, right? Yeah, true. It's not an official part of the Decamp Manifesto, so I guess we can do it. <laughs> Even if it were, forget it. <laughs> you know, guys, I feel really isolated. I'm all the way up uh, in northwestern Pennsylvania. I'm so far away from all you guys. Where in yeah. northwestern Pennsylvania? Erie County. Oh, so like up north, up up towards um, almost towards the, like the Niagara Falls kind of area. Not where like, you at, Nicholas City. I'm, I'm ninety. I'm ninety two miles east of or ninety two miles west of Niagara Falls. Were you at Nickel City? Yes, I was. Well, did you see my talk on the last day? Yes, I did. Oh no, I was only there for one day because I did not know about the Nickel City Ruby Conference until the night. Before the the conference, how dare you? So um, I couldn't get anybody to hang out and watch my place, so I could be overnight in Buffalo. And how dare you? Not how go to dare my talk. Hang on, guys, real quick. I just want to go offline because I think we're uh, we're done with the main Ruby hangout, so we're just, we can keep hanging out. I'm just going to turn off the YouTube stream. So okay. <laughs> Uh, yeah, no, I didn't snub you on purpose, dude. I, did, I if I would have known.